So what is positive content? Uh, well, positive content simply has to respond to certain criteria, but I think what the, I'll say mainly is what it develops in the child. We have a, a lot of research done on child development and the different kinds of uh, things they need to learn and develop, like empathy, social emotional learning, uh, principles like democracy, participation, creation, all of the all of the contents that develop these kind of traits that are linked to the research about a healthy child development are useful and are positive. So in terms of the tips and tricks for parents, I would encourage them greatly to use the repositories, the online repositories of positive content online. One example is the Better Internet for Kids portal, which has a lot of resources uh, of where to find positive content. You have, for instance, search engines that are geared spe specifically for children content. Uh, you have all kinds of different websites and all kinds of different languages. Uh, then you have also, even our organizations are doing it, hosting, for instance, portals for parents where they can exchange and share whatever content they found. Uh, you have expert websites created by uh, child development experts like Common Sense Media, which really cherry pick and find the best content for, for, for children, be it apps, websites, so really, I would encourage them to look through those kinds of resources to find the best content.